how you are. You just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. 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 Hi. You ever just wake up late at night? You know, hungry. You're lonesome. You're in bed. Thought about wanking. Boy or girl. Maybe you thought about flicking the bean or rubbing off the little wiener dog. And you want to go out in your kitchen? You open up your fridge? You check for some goodies? And you look inside and what do you got in there, dude? Just sauce. Hey. <laughs> Have a seat. Are you alright, dude? Yeah. You look like you're gonna cry. Might. Why are you smiling? Why are you just walk, <laughs> walking while we were recording? You can have a seat if you want. You want to be in the podcast today? I'm lay on the ground. Why are you moving? Oh, you got your little dab Rooney guy. You can't smoke that. Anymore. I'm not trying to, because no, I'll just, I'm not going to do it now. You know what I'm saying? For the kids. Not for the kids. Just so like I don't, so I can think and stuff. <laughs> I'll, and I'll be spacing. Yeah, and for the kids. Yeah. Fuck kids. Not literally, but you know what I'm saying. <clears throat> you seem fucked up. What? Why are you breathing hard? Who's breathing hard? I can hear you breathing. I'm, I'm, I'm concentrating. <laughs> Asking me something now. I'm super concentrated. Right All right. Um, what, what do you think about Albert Einstein? And what he contributed to life? I have no idea. Yeah, neither yeah. do I. I, 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 I was really... Has, has he really affected my life? No. Do you want to be on camera? Not my... Has he really affected my life? You don't want to be in the podcast? I, I'm talking. You, so this is a podcast right now? Can I talk to you? I mean, I have to do my intro right now. Can I'm. be friends? Huh? Yeah? Yeah. All right. I got some macchiato. Oh, but this is like nice. pistachio macchiato with like an extra sp- uh, shot of expre- espresso. That sounds too much. I wanted to be zooted. Dude, I, I wanted to get an iced coffee, but I forgot. Dude, it's so good. I, got, I, got, I ate a freaking banana this is pistachio flavored. protein bar that's for free at LA Fitness. Pistachio. It's garbage. Pistachio flavor. <laughs> is it bad? It's banana? Yeah. Banana's are good. Yeah, but it tastes like shit. <laughs> it wasn't very good. I didn't like it. It made my mouth super freaking dry. Did you lift? Dude, you know me, man. So you didn't? No, he didn't. He, no, he went there, he went in the sauna and fell asleep. <laughs> <laughs> it was nice, though. <laughs> it was a nice sauna. Sauna safe. Did you sweat? I, I No, I didn't do sweat. I wanted to... I didn't do sweat. <laughs> I wanted to come here really fast. I was hoping you'd be here when I came here. I was like, I dang. Late. All right, what's well, fine. Just don't let it happen again. Is mom sleeping on you? No, she's not. She's awake again. She seems sleeping. No, yeah, she's, she's awake. Like lying down. Mm-hmm. Like she's awake. Up. She's awake. Jet lag. Where, where did she come from? Where did she go? I don't know, Cotton Eye Joe. Dude, it's like 80% fucking humidity outside. I walked out from my class and my hands got like clammy. And like, I just like rubbed it on my fucking leg. And I saw like the moist, like just, you know when your leg gets wet? You know when your leg gets wet? And like all your fucking hairs like stick That's together. Disgusting. That's what it was, man. That's gross. It's fucking gross as shit outside. That's really fucking gross. I want to live. That's super. Gross. I really want to live somewhere where it's just super dry. Like Arizona. Dude, it's so cold at night in Arizona, but it's so fucking hot during the day. Yeah. Fuck that. Man. I got a friend who lives There's in Arizona. Scorpions. Scorpions in Arizona, man. But those are the poisonous kind. There's also rattlesnakes and shit. There's also no green. Dude, I feel like... You're, any, that's like... Well, no, I feel you, like any place... No that, one's living in the desert, dude. Like, there's... You know what I mean? I'm trying to live in the suburbs, wait, wait, maybe. What do you mean? In the... You're saying there's rattlesnakes and scorpions. Shit, beat, man. I guarantee people... Oh, god damn it. <laughs> dude, you know there's there, there's rattlesnakes in, in the, the desert. Rattlesnakes go in the, their, those people's houses all the fucking time, bro. Through their toilet and stuff? I don't, I don't know about toilet. I think just basements and Well, stuff. I know in Australia... There's just fucking animals living in people's backyards, like tarantulas, no. size of like this big. When people say you yeah. swallow like seven spiders a year, dude, imagine fucking eating a tarantula just like this big is like a fucking burger. 
how you just take a bite every night for like a couple of weeks. Where is that? Arizona? Australia. Oh. Dude, what's going <laughs> <laughs> no, there's a, have, you ever, have you ever seen, you know, uh, Scorpions, Bosnia too? Well, like. Dude, just... I remember as a kid, like growing up, my like when we used to uh, go to my grandpa's house, uh, I remember seeing there were scorpions coming out of like crevices and stuff. But then at their freaking house, like a lot of the time at night, when going right before going to sleep, we see freaking scorpions going right across the, the ceiling, like two of them. The ceiling. I swear to God, my my my, I dude, Allah, bro, bro, Allah, dude. I swear to God, dude, Allah, dude, 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 I swear to God. Yo, you believe in God, man? You believe I'm not in lying, but like anyways. okay, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not lying. All right, all right, fine. I believe that scorpions can just run across the ceiling. That's fine. Not like run across. They're not like you know. Well, that's the way you fucking fucking explained it. (laughs) You're like, they're like me across the fucking ceiling. They're not goddamn the same ball, bro. I'm not. I'm just saying like they were there. Like they're all they're running. They're playing around. They're fucking around. You know. Speaking of you saying bolt, did you see he's like he's trying? He's gonna do a, I think either a oh. A six-week trial yeah. with, like, that one fucking African team. Or maybe the Jamaican team. Ah, uh, I think it was an African team. Is it African? Yeah, like South African or something. Well, he's just going to be ass. He's going to be ass. <laughs> like, he's not, a, was, so- he's not was, a soccer player. Dude, dude, it was killing me. He's, the, he's fucking bear from uh, Bush. Like, what are the Bush? The Alaskan Bush people. <laughs> he just fucking runs. That's all he does. I, I watched it again. I watched it with that girl last night. Yeah. In order to, like... Dude. Dude, that was funny as shit. <laughs> Chris, listen. Listen to this. All right? <laughs> I didn't tell me. He's like, hey, man, we can hang out later. And I was like, I was, I got done studying. I got coffee with this one girl for like a little bit. <laughs> and I was like, all right, after this coffee, I'm going to go hang out with Aiden. Call Aiden like six times, like three times, probably twice. I call him I twice. Up, so I'm assuming like, oh, he's asleep. I'm going to just go like wake him up. I like walk to his backyard. He's with some like blonde chick. Oh, and yeah. like. I had no idea how to, like, react because I was like, oh, dude, this is definitely that, like, hippie chick. The one that talks to spirits in the uh, tank, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I was like, huh? That's not the one? No, that's not the one. It's kind of girl. That one, that, yeah, she's Dude, how many cool. fucking girls do you know now? I know you're just girls. You're literally talking to girls just so you can get deals for shit that you buy. That's amazing. Mm. I got... How many free float sessions did you get? What? I'm doing. <laughs> what, dude? Well, it's really like seventy bucks. Yeah, I got, I, I, she gave me two. She gave me two like trial things. It's like two thirty-minute trials. Jesus Christ. Well, hey, since we're since we're just doing this podcast, can yeah. I can I tell my my sponsor really quick? Sure. You know, since this is just like salam. You know, what I mean, assalamu yeah. assalamu alaikum, brothers. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Um. Hey, while he's doing that, can you give me that stool over there? Yeah, grab grab that stool for my my uh, Chrissy Chris. If you can just sit next to him. That's, that's Dude, come here. Just literally sit right next to me. Sit on the couch, man. And we can do a podcast together. It'll be fun. I need water. I got you. If you don't mind. You, um, fuck, this is all fucked. <laughs> water. I got water. I got my, there's my water outside. Oh, we can just edit this shit out. You know what I mean? This is fine. Here. Oh, yeah, move all that stuff. Go for it. You're barefoot, too. That's. You want me to go barefoot, too? Yeah, man. I'm not going to lie. It is it's like... Part of nature. Mm. I'll go barefoot too. There you go. There you go. It feels better on my toes, man. I feel like I'm in prison. I'm not gonna lie, this carpet's not that great for my toes. I'll be honest. But it's a little dirty. Yeah. It's okay. We should go to my house and go play with our feet there. Uh, yeah, I went to his house once, and it was it was that girl and some other dude just sitting there. Yeah, I told yeah, him. I, I invited him. I was gonna do some weird shit when I walked back there. I, I, I invited him over, and it was them again. Like it was a group. Of, it was it was it was two of them. It was. Okay, so there was well, this. Here, was just, uh, I was right. walking to his house, and I could smell weed from the drive the driveway. So right. I'm like, oh, he's back here. But I, don't I know. saw the bugs after. Oh, he's back here. I was gonna do some crazy shit. They go back there. I'm like, ah. Uh. Like, who are you people? <laughs> <laughs> who the fuck are You're you? Just random ass fucking people. Yeah. No, I told him I was gonna surprise him, and like I was uh, inside with all these random people in my backyard. Jesus Christ. Dude, I walked back there and he's just chilling and I was just as awkward as possible. Just it was like on, funny, man. on purpose as shit. Yeah. I was like, um, uh, anyways, um, sh- uh, I'll what talk to you guys later. <laughs> no, she wasn't. I like her. But no, but no, we were all like, we were, we were sitting there and then he was saying like, hey, can, can, can I chill out with you guys? Can I, can, can I, can I say around hang? He was being all weird. I didn't and say that. I was like, should I just like, like, I don't know if you guys want me to stay or leave or like, dude, just go home. I was like, all right. 
<laughs> and I, I just bounced. Oh man, you guys suck. And then I remember that, and I just like cracked up laughing again. <laughs> I wanted to hang out. He was so. <coughs> he was like, he I was drove. I was like, I don't want to go fucking home now. He was, he was very like, disappointed. I knew if I went home, I was just gonna shower and go to bed because I was so tired. And that's what you did. I just wanted to hang out. I didn't know you were with a like, little little uh, woman. That's okay. They're a little shitty gang. But it was just her. Look at that. Song. Oh, it's getting better. Uh, he said so he hurts. hates their friends. Her friends. Yeah, they like, suck, dude. I was like, well, they just don't hang out with them. He's like, what do you mean? <laughs> I was like, what do you think I mean? Dude, like, I really hate her friends. Like, her friends are like the most dull human beings in the world. Yeah, because they're like white and yeah, that's girls. true. No, one of them was a dude, bro. Oh, okay. He was just like a little. Hey, man, I like to smoke yeah. pot and drop acid. Yeah, that was him actually. <laughs> Life story. He, he, he was wearing a. Uh, you would actually have liked his, I think, clothes. I would have liked his clothes. Yeah, so, yeah. I don't like his, his, his shirt, bro. Uh, he said, "Bro, that was a tight shirt." I feel like you would have said, "Bro, that's a tight shirt" or something. What was he? You would have said something gay like that. What was that. he wearing? Gucci. I don't fucking know. What some, was it? Some shit. Dude, I would yeah, never. Oh, uh, I would never call another man. It on was guess. I would never compliment like a person, a man that's not my friend. I would never compliment him on his like style. No, yeah. no shot. That's just a complete stranger. No, it, it's just like odd. Oh my Except god. Unless they're wearing, wearing Wrangler U shaped jeans. Yeah, then it's like, hey man. Wrangler, you should. You know what the fuck is up. What are you doing down there? You must got a hog down there. It's like, hey man, I see you got the Wranglers on. Jesus. You're right. You're white. You know what I mean? I've never seen a black guy wear fucking Wranglers because that's just like, that doesn't happen. You know what I mean? What do they wear? Fubu and, uh,. Uh, Bro, I used to wear FUBU. I, mean, I know you did. Bro, oh. <laughs> dude, I used to wear FUBU. When I was like, oh my god, I had a when I was in like I think fourth grade. My brother, uh, he kissed he, you. No, I mean other than that, on the lips. We, yeah, other than that, <laughs> like why do we always gotta bring shit like that up? Though? Like, why can't we keep anything private between right, friends? Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Go for it. Um, let's move on. Uh, my brother didn't kiss me. All right, <laughs> right dude, just fucking drop it. It's fine. <laughs> You're the one mentioning it. I didn't say anything about my brother kissing me. I mean, I didn't think I was that was gonna, brought up. I didn't think I was gonna guess your like, <laughs> you know, relationship with your brother like that. But okay, man, uh, we talk about it all the time. Like, how do we not gonna bring? It? All right, whatever. Anyways, that's that's a lie. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> it so- sounds like you meant that. <laughs> Sounds like that's a lie. Where was I going with this? Oh, your brother. You wear FUBU. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. My brother. Uh, Poor bu- shit. Uh, yeah. Poor uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, my brother My brother took me when I was a kid, um, like fourth grade. Took me to some store. He bought me a FUBU shirt. It literally said FUBU on it over and over and over and over again. Like all over? Yeah, all over it. That probably looked nice as fuck. It was just like all, and it was all red and blue, red and blue, red and blue. It was just like that. Yeah. It was like long sleeve. It was dope as hell. I got mad respect. I had, I wore like a white beefer, under, white, white, what, white, what is it called? White beater or white beefer? White be, wife beater. What? Azure, because Azure. dudes, because oh, dudes, white beefer. White, oh, <laughs> it's a guy who better. beats his wife. He'll come home. He's like, hey, what the fuck is my dinner? <laughs> Where's my beef? He's coming home in a white beater from work. And he's like, what the fuck is my dinner? And then she doesn't have the dinner ready. And he just starts fucking wailing on her because he, wife beater. White beefer. That's what, yeah. We're a white beefer. <laughs> A white man who always creates beef. <laughs> he always wants beef. Where is the beef? Fogo de Chao. Dude. That's where the beef is. <sighs> motherfuckers don't know about Fogo de Chao because motherfuckers be poor, boy. We ain't poor. <laughs> no. I'm poor, but I got a decently rich friend, so I'm not no! poor. <laughs> so long. Hey, man, listen. If you never ate at Fogo de Chao, you oh, never heard, if you never heard of it, you're poor. Okay. That's a fucking fact. You can sit there and say, oh, I, I make $1,000 a day. You never ate at Fogo de Chao, you're poor. I don't make that much money. I ate at Fogo de Chao. I'm not poor. That's a fucking fact. Dude, it's so hot in here, man. It's all, this, it's all the movement you do, bro. Maybe, yeah. Dude, maybe it's, this, my shirt off. maybe it's this fucking uh, coffee. Would that be gay? Yeah, man. I forgot to bring your jersey that you gave me. My Roma one. Yeah, I have a clean. Oh, Ronaldo to Roma. Roma or Juventus, <laughs> dude. Did you see that Bill Burr rant on the so- soccer? No. It was really funny. How much he, he loves saying? it now. He likes soccer. He watched Croatia versus Russia and he loves it now. Well, that's because it was, funny. It was a great game, Croatia Russia. Oh, yeah. But no, um, yeah, Ronaldo to Juventus. That's freaking crazy, man. It's dumb as fuck. I know. It's gonna be He's, the league community. is going to be destroyed. The league is destroyed now. Do you think Roma has a chance? Nobody has a chance. Napoli has no chance. Nobody's going to catch him. 
Inter took Nygolan. Yeah, that's true. It's a Jer- sad day. Jordinho. Jer- it's a sad day for white people and the blacks. Oh, my God. I don't know what that one meant, but, like, yeah. Explain soccer <clears throat> to somebody who's never watched All right, here. here I'll, you know what? What you're saying is fucking boring. I'll, I'll explain it. I'll explain it as, as easily as I can. Soccer, most watched sport around the world. Okay. It's the oldest, I feel like. Isn't it, like, the oldest, yeah. like, sport today? No, I don't know, man. That's how much of that matters. It's still what you said was boring. I don't care if people like soccer. Do you know who fucking Ronaldo is? Yeah, dude. I feel like the average like human just knows who Ronaldo is. Yeah. And he left Real Madrid. And Real Madrid's like the, the, biggest well, the most world. well-known team. If you don't even watch soccer, you should at least know who Real Madrid and Ronaldo is. He left Real Madrid and he's been there for like ever. That motherfucker's making 30 million. Dude, that dude had so much plastic surgery done on himself though. Yeah, if I had money, I'd be fucking making myself look amazing yeah, as well. Like, it would be like, yeah, I would just like... I do. Oh my god, dude! I'll give those like leg implants. You know those mother. You know those like those. Ma- I'll get leg implants. You so know that's, just that's, that's, <laughs> just like <weird>. th- <laughs> that's just weird. Like that. That's just weird. Why are you insecure about your thighs? <laughs> <laughs> so we'll put some put some thigh implants on. Dude, check, I don't. W- <laughs> check these fucking bad boys out. You see that? You see that shit, dude? Uh, yeah. I don't need that. I'm not insecure about my thighs. That's a beefer. Dude, that's- I saw a picture of Kim Kardashian. Dude, she gave birth twice. You know? Yeah, I saw that tweet. Right? You know who also gave birth twice? My mom. Yeah. <laughs> you know what my mom looks like, dude? A mom. Like, yeah. a mom. Like, a mom. Dude, Kim Kardashian looks I haven't seen like she's yet. like 18. Skinny ass shit. Like, just skinny stomach. You know what I mean? The bitch literally just evaporated a baby out of her body. <laughs> she didn't give birth. There's no fucking... Or the baby's just fake as fuck. It's not her baby. And then people I say, people say that's her baby. Obviously, it is. But she has so much money, dude. She's like, I'm going to just make myself look perfect. But why is she popular, bro? Because she's <coughs> hot as hell. And they had like that shitty ass. They're retarded, though. Dude, without. Jesus. Wait. Should I say Caitlyn Jenner or Bruce Jenner? You should say. All right, without Bruce Jenner, there would be nothing. I'm saying Bruce. There would be no Caitlyn Jenner without Bruce Jenner. That's so, so fucking true, dude. Oh. That's a conundrum Which right came there. First? Huh? Which came first? <laughs> wow! What came oh, first, Caitlyn or Bruce? That's the real question. Yeah, which one like, was oh my god, he, she was which, always Caitlyn. What, which one did you identify? She was always first? Caitlyn. Yeah, that's what they. Even when he won the Olympics. <laughs> no, no. I don't know. Even when he won the Olympics, was he Caitlyn? That's what they said. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Depends on who you ask. The question. Does is, he still have his like medals? He better not. Um, Does he? <laughs> He's yeah. a ge- hey, it's just a law. So what, you changed gender. You lost your ma- male male ship. You lost your medal for that fucking thing, man. I mean, that does kind of make sense. Fuck. You know what I mean? You're not a fucking but it's man. In the past. But like the past doesn't matter. It matters like now. You <laughs> yeah, know what I mean? It matters now. The record books, bro. It. I mean, like records, like oh, who's know, Bruce man. Jenner? I don't, I don't fucking know. But honestly, though, you know I don't. Know I mean? Everyone knows. No, I don't. Honestly, though, I don't care. I don't care. Huh? I don't I, care about. I him. care one hundred percent. I love. The Kardashians. Mm-hmm. So you guys are downing your drinks. Yeah. I'm the. I like water, man. I'm thirsty. It's really hot in here. You want to try some of that? No, it's water. It is down. hot as fuck in here. That's man. just watered down, bro. That's like the worst yes. part when it's all watered down like that. Well, yeah, it's because it's like it was so hot out. There was like oh, a, there was like 50 ice cubes so, and it just melted. Just gr- all right. Make them feel bad. No, that's just the worst part bad. of it. That's I would, the worst that was part refreshing of it. as shit. That's what you say on the outside. That's the worst part of the drink right there, man. It's like the fucking uh, melted part. It's like, I don't like that. Well, I don't know. Why should, I just, should I just fucking kill myself? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what do you want from fucking me? Fucking throw it away. Get it out of my fucking sight. <laughs> throw it away. Dude, throw this is delicious. Around. That's fucking... Like, I mean, just fucking deal. Like. <laughs> you know? I drink some of that, and now I feel like I can just, like, take on a whole village of tiny black boys. You probably could. You probably in Ethiopia. Could. You, you probably could not. Than yours. Dude, they would kick your fucking ass. Yeah. Dude. How many of them? How many of them can you fight? What, like, little Ethiopian people? Yeah, but, like... Well, are yeah, they, aren't Ethiopian. They? Yeah, Ethiopian. All right, all right. They're, that's pretty similar to fucking okay, culture, right? Okay, since... All right, well, Ethiopia, since they're... I know a decent amount of Ethiopia. I feel like so if I just... All right, if you walk into a village, right? You know, you're just in Ethiopia. Yeah. You're hanging out with your family. I don't okay. You know. Mm-hmm. You walk into a village because people are like, oh, there's a village nearby. Yeah. And there's, like, seven little Ethiopian men. Cause men or children? Men. They're little because they're, they're malnutrition. Like, they're, they're malnourished. Not. <laughs> I don't think I don't think Ethiopia's a male. Like they're malnourished, so they're smaller. They don't have, small? Yeah, they're smaller people. Like they're midgets. It's like five five. I don't think that's an Ethiopian. They're like five I think six. Like, five four. 
like when have you ever Somalians seen? are like super tall. I feel like Bro, Ethiopians are no, super small. Ethiopia is like pretty developed out of Africa, man. Are you sure? No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I swear it's Sudan. Uh, Sudan's not. If you said Sudan, I would say, all right. All right, fine. All right. Well, the first fucking country that came to my mind was Ethiopia. Don't, I don't like, say Ethiopia. I like saying the word Ethiopia. That's just me, man. Like, Ethiopia. Like, that sounds like a fucking music festival. I don't think you can take any Ethiopians. I think they'd all be... They will kick his ass. All right, let's say you walk into the village, right? You greet, yeah, yeah, you yeah, greet right. them, Sorry. and you're like, oh, assalamu alaikum. Assalamu You know, alaykum. culture. You, you're very... Cultural. You're very cultural, okay? Very kind. And, and you go inside, and you're like, hey, assalamu alaikum. They invite you into their house. You know, it's a big house. They all live in one house because uh-huh. it's like... They're, they're poor. They're one big family, ancestral and stuff. And they don't have money? Yeah, basically. I don't they don't know. have the wealth? And you have a knife. You know, you have a knife in your back pocket, and the one guy comes up to you, he's like, I, I want to do you. He wants to do you? Do you. Do you. Do you. Do you. Do so you go outside. All right. You guys are in. You guys are outside the house. And he thinks you don't have anything on you. Right? Mm-hmm. You're just man, man to man fist. All right. All right. Put your dukes up right, right. now. Dukes are up. All right. Okay. Go okay. Ahead. And he goes like, do you have any weapons on you? What do you say? Uh, I do not. You're not going to be honest? You're not going to say you have a knife in your back Fuck pocket? Fuck no. Yeah, no. Why would you do that? Why would I say you have a knife in my back pocket? would ever do that. Are you serious? What, are you going to use the knife? If I had if to. If he wants to, yeah. Yeah. If, uh, if I right. was getting my ass beat. <laughs> if he was like, if, if he started like doing something that like, what if, he wouldn't stop. What if like he beat the shit out of you and yeah. like you fell on your face and then like your knife went out of your pocket mm-hmm. and you told him that you didn't have any weapons on you? And it would beat my ass? He probably doesn't know what a knife is. Yeah. His, his people have never seen a knife. If anything, they were the ones that created knives. <laughs> oh, <no>. Yes, <laughs> with like fucking like elephant like trunks and shit. They were making like Who? goddamn swords way way back in the Dizay. Who? Ethiopians. No, you're talking about this villager. Yeah, exactly. Where is Ethiopia? No, we weren't talking about Ethiopia. We we already established <laughs> Ethiopia is fucking civilized. Is that in sub-Saharan Africa? I don't know what village you guys are talking about, but we're like um, we we established that Ethiopia is civilized. I'm sorry, if they they invented knives, this other person doesn't have a knife, and they need money from me. Are you kidding me? No, you won't really bother me. Okay. All right, I'll be honest. All right, man. I'll be honest here. <laughs> Too honest. <laughs> no, no, you can't just oh, fucking do that. Listen, go ahead. Just all right, all right, say right. it. Say it as politely. You was really weird. All right, I'll tell right. All right, go I'll, for I'll, it. I'll, I'll refrain from saying my. It's so hard. I'll refrain. Three people are in here. You what's really it. weird, dude? You want I, the one thing I can't understand is like all those motherfuckers that continuously donate money to like causes in like these fucking countries, then they get nothing fucking done with that money because it goes to those like corrupt people, man. But it's so shit because they continually ask for something that's going to be continuously given, like, to those corrupt people. So it's like a continuous circle of fuckery in so Africa you, and, you... like, a lot of the other undeveloped world, which is a fact. You know what I mean? So what's the solution? But, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's so, those motherfuckers annoy the living shit out of me. Because I feel like, all right, in Africa, I feel like, you, you, what, they say what? Like, um... Five dollars a day will feed a family of like fucking twenty two in Africa for like a week. Yeah, man, rice is pretty cheap. Yeah, you and just then fucking eat handfuls of rice every day. You dude, see that they'll, shit? they'll survive. Like people, I Sudan, see that shit all the time on YouTube. Dude. Yeah, man, people will die in Sudan from starvation. People will die in well, not Venezuela. Was it Venezuela? Or? Yo, Venezuela is super. Is it hard. Venezuela right now? Oh, the socialists. Yeah, Venezuela is yeah. super. They're poor. fucked, dude. Super like people are dying poor. from starvation there too, super man. Super poor. Like. But like all the, the all the money that gets donated doesn't go to those those people that need help. It just goes to like somebody else. So what's the solution? No, I don't know, but like it's annoying. Just like don't donate. I I don't want to donate to those people anymore. I'm tired of it, man. You know who the fuck the real heroes donate are. Donate to people that like are more vetted, man. Find out people that are vetted. The real heroes are those. I don't like. I donate to that. that never mind. No, go ahead. Donate. Donate Muslim, my son. The Muslim Brotherhood. <laughs> ISIS? Definitely not. I donate to ISIS monthly. I'm not, uh, you get a su- subscription? Yeah, they send me like keychains and shit. Bro, all watch the your NSA ha- like I next week. I got this week, little ISIS a... bottle opener, dude. It's fucking tight. Dude, the NSA is totally going to bug this room after the, after this week. I, I please. <laughs> fucking NSA. All the shit that you say, I like. Yeah. You're on a list, dude. I'm a. Li- oh. <laughs> I say ridiculous shit. I don't. I don't mean half the shit I say. I mean everything I say. That's very sincere, but okay. Just 
I'm, I'm just trying to, you know, get, get some dyna- deniability from kidding, this. guys. It's fine. A lot of the shit I say is, are just jokes. Everyone needs to, needs to know this. No, but the real heroes are those Christians that go down to Africa and help the children. Or, like, they go down to Haiti and they're like, and they, yeah. they, post, on, they post pictures on Instagram and they're like, oh my God, I'm helping these poor children. And that's cool, I guess. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that's the only thing that you can do, like, directly. He's like, you literally have to go to the country and help them. Buy, yeah, buy a goat. Here, here's a goat. Don't donate. Here's a goat. You want to help them? Build them Fucking leave, dude. Huh? Fucking get out of here. Seriously. F- saying every donation that goes just is corrupt. It just doesn't even Dude, matter. I feel like a lot of them are. I'm not saying every one of them isn't, but like, I, I mean, feel no, like a lot just, of them are. I feel like they just are. Well, how about you them. just stop donating and then, and then they have to fix their shit by themselves? Oh, that's a good idea. I'm saying <laughs> we go to Africa, dude, right? My money's not. My money hasn't been helping them, dude. The money I appreciate. Uh, no, dude, all that money I have given them. <laughs> no, I haven't given my money to Africa. Why not? Never. No. You never give any Africans some money, dude. See them on the street, like, hey, man, you really need this. I know you do. I mean, I've given, I've given, you know. Yo, what the fuck, dude? I'm not sure if any. I've, yeah, I'm not sure if anyone was was African. I've given, I've given money to black people, white people. Do you believe everybody's originally from? Not Africa? Asian people. Not Asian people. Yeah. Asian mean, people aren't fucking homeless. I mean, also they're they're really hard well fucking off. working. They're really well off. Yeah, they're hard. Dude, working. what's the currency like from like the Chinese currency to American currency? I know Chinese currency is like super fucking strong. I'm not sure. Cause like that's why the those yen? those fucking Asians are so rich at school, driving like Porsches leased out. I don't. Know. I think they're just rich, bro. I think their family's just rich. Dude. Yeah, that's what I think, man. There's, I don't think the currency. Like, like, it's not like everybody in China. Yeah. Is like, <laughs> like, definitely not. not. Yeah. No, no. Definitely not. I look at the Chinese currency. Look- yeah, no, but I'm not sure if that like affects the fact that like they're rich or not. The fact that the currency is high or not. No, I think they do have a large gap mm. in their. What's this mean? Wealth. No, they do. It means the dollar is stronger. Really? Yes. Of course it is. Zero point fifty, and then China is three point five. Yes, a fifty fifty cents is uh, three fifty yen. Is that yen or whatever? Is that what they're using? Uh, Chinese yen, yeah. Chinese so one one dollar is one dollar is. Let's look up. One dollar. Just do yen. T- just do uh, dollar cn. How do, what's yen? How do you fucking care? cn one? Or is it yen? Man, these Chinese people with their currency, man, they're fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> I for one respect. Six point seven one. One dollar for six point seven one yen. I don't know what I was fucking looking at, cause there I saw this fucking thing. Where someone had like three thousand, it was like Asian currency, yeah. and it was like to American currency it was like way fucking more than three thousand. I was like, wow. I was like, this is why they're so fucking rich. Did you see that? I was like, I was looking at an article and I was fucking looking at it, but I, I, I couldn't remember if it was China or some shit else. Dude, it's so fucking hot in here, dude, man. Do you know those like uh, Arab countries actually give those uh, kids like money to go over to America to study? Really? Yeah, like oh, they pay for it. They pay for their schooling and, like, a lot of the other stuff. Like, the United Arab Emirates, oh. like, literally pays for you to go to, like, school in America, pays for your car, pays for your apartment, pays for everything. That but makes you have, sense. But you come back and work. We have, like, the best schools. But how cool is that? Like, that's a really cool uh, thing. Do we that. have the best schools? Yeah, we do. Yeah. Like, absolutely? Yeah, 100%. Yeah. Like, in Harrisburg, we have the best schools? <laughs> no. It's called Angus. <laughs> He's like giggling. <laughs> we gotta be specific. Why are you gonna send? He's got his giggles. If you're a uh, fucking sheik in the United Arab Emirates, why are you gonna send your f- fucking kid to hack? Like, what are you talking about? Well, there's a lot. Which of actually kids. is one of the best community colleges in and America. There were some in uh, Penn yeah, State, Harrisburg. I knew some kids that like lived in Dubai from Penn State, Harrisburg. It's like, the fuck. <laughs> yeah. But uh, yeah, that's a good. They gotta go fucking back. Penn State. Yeah. Get 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 back. Yeah. I like I like the Arabs, man. I met the Arabs in spring break. That was a fun time. Arabs got me into uh, the Tiger VIP. Good time. What kind of drugs do you do, man? I don't do drugs. Hey. I'm clean. Hey. We don't do drugs around here. Oh, no, sir. We just no, watch sir. people do drugs on TV, and That's then I right. imagine doing them, and then I pretend to be high. That's right. I don't know what that meant, but yeah, that's right, kids. Children. Um, so what do you think about this whole uh, Trump siding with uh, P- uh, Putin, man? What do you mean 
mean siding? What? Are you siding with him now? Well, they they asked a question about about the whole collusion thing, and he was like, "I don't I don't see why Russia would or something." Yeah. But he was basically saying like, "Oh, Putin said he didn't do it, so I believe him." And people are all calling like Trump a traitor and like a trees like committed treason and shit. Like every day. It's nothing new. Like, he was like siding. Yeah, I'm with excited Putin. for the debate. So he's siding with Putin. Like, he was saying Russia didn't do it, but like, well, of course he's saying that. That's because he was next to because he was next saying, to Putin, right? He's been saying, bro. That, do you want him excited though? But now he's saying know. Russia has. Now he's just saying like, yeah, they've done it. No, he didn't. but he, he didn't said, say it when he, he was like next I to trust Putin. Trust the intelligence communities or whatever. But he was like washy washy. He's saying something else, and now he's saying something else. That's like. What, that's what People do. You do that. Everybody Presidents do don't do that. Yeah, they do. Are you fucking retarded? <laughs> Hillary Clinton, bro. Everybody's done that. Freaking Hillary Clinton. Politicians are they're liars. She's wishy washy. <laughs> I mean, like, <laughs> not as much as Trump. I feel like this is like well, a whole new like, sure. age of like lying. They're all wishy washy, man. man. Like literally all politicians, but a lot of all. I feel like. Hey, remember like? You probably you guys don't remember, but I think it was the 2012 yeah election when Mitt Romney said that like. Russia was the greatest threat to American national security, and everybody laughed at him. They laughed at him. <laughs> You're stupid. <laughs> what do you think this is the Cold War? <laughs> You're stupid. I love Obama. The Mormons the were Russians right. Russians aren't scary. Now the Russians are fucking. <laughs> He's so passionate about that. I love it. Yeah, well, people people are fucking retarded. Like that that was like uh, five years ago. Like everybody forgot about it. Everyone's they're just hypocrites. They're stupid. Fake news. Fake news. I you, don't know. You support Trump, man? No. But, dude, you want know I can't? I, I support... I, I support... Uh, no, I don't. I, <laughs> I don't know what I support, man. I just support somebody making my life easier. That's what I support. That's ISIS. true. That's ISIS. That's that ISIS? I didn't think if any, <laughs> well, how the yeah, fuck yeah. does ISIS make my life if easier? If anyone's going to make hate your life easier, it's ISIS. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, him? Yeah. yeah. Like, They'd be like, we heard what you said all those years. Do we like you. You're on our team. You gotta play my name out now. I, dude, I got a fucking career. What the <laughs> fuck is this? Your life is over now. Nah, you're fucked. I'll just say your name is um, Apu or something. I don't fucking know. Right. All right, Apu. <laughs> I swear to God, man. What? Right, Are you nervous? No, man. That's funny. Like, you can't... There's no other, like, group of people of yeah. any race or religion that just can't associate with some, like, group. Yeah. <laughs> just Muslims are fucked forever. I mean, like... The, jo- the Japanese had it pretty tough during World War Two. They did. Don't... Yep. They were playing <laughs> fucking concentration camps, bro. Right. Were you the one that showed They're me... They're concentrating. Uh, we, the, like, the year after that the war sucks, ended, they could be like, yo, I love Imperial Japan, and everyone would be like, if you fucking said that, <laughs> you'd go to jail. Dude, that was crazy. Yeah, they used to just put them in jail, man. Like, just Japanese people. Good. For what? For being Japanese. Yeah. Are you serious? I swear to God, America. Oh, yeah, they're in constant little concentration. Yeah, camps, man. Yeah. America just, like, locked people, Japanese people up. It's like, fuck that. We can't trust them. Yeah. I mean, we were going to war. I, back then, they were just, like, also super scared. I mean, we never experienced, like, or I've never seen a nuclear bomb happen, like, on another fucking... Yeah, but America was the one that dropped the nuclear bomb. Wait, what? Yeah, that was yeah. way after we turned them. Yeah, but... But I'm saying, like, it was just a crazy-ass time back then. You know what I mean? I'm not saying, like, they dropped a bomb and then now we're fucking hoarding a bunch of Japanese people. I'm saying, like, back then it was just so insane. Like, they're hoarding Japanese people and we're also dropping bombs. They're dropping nukes on, like, countries. Yeah. Yeah. Like, back then it was just insane. Like, nowadays... I mean, I guess we, like, see Moabs and shit and drones. They're amazing. Like, you know? Drones are crazy. But if it, it, imagine What's if a, a nuclear Moab? bomb, like, fucking went off, dude. Uh... Mother of all bombs. Mother of all bombs. That's was it ICBM, inter- intercontinental ballistic missile or some yeah. shit? No, what's that? Uh, oh, the rods from God. Rods from God, bro. <gasps> what is Those it? Those are crazy. They're Chris, not can d- this... they're not real yet. Not yet. But what is it? Real. They had like smaller ones in Vietnam. It's just the space station floating above Earth. Space they... Force. Yeah. That's what it's used for, yeah. bro. They're That's Trump's talk. idea, did I man. I, did I tell you my job entitlement on Tinder? I said Space Force. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Oh, I've, all right, I told you guys. Has it worked? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Dude, I, I only know. have like ten matches and like it's just because of my fucking pictures, dude. I need to post like <laughs> regular pictures. <laughs> but like <laughs> I know pictures, they're fucking amazing. Are amazing. They're really funny. Alright, describe to everyone what your pictures are okay. Okay. on Tinder. I, oh, did you? Alright, oh, fucking fuck me. Right, it's right, describe it again. No, fuck, I'll show you. Show, show, show it to everybody. Show it again. Show, well, show, well, show well, it and describe it, please. While you're doing that, I'll explain Rods from God. Alright, go for it. It's just like a space station or something up there that has these like I think they're like uh, 20 feet long steel beams, and yeah. they just release them from orbit on the Earth, and they just gain speed. And, and they just fucking they hit bomb some the motherfuckers? Earth. It creates an uh, explosion the size of like a nuclear explosion, but with no fallout or nuclear waste or anything like that. Wow. <laughs> from <laughs> fucking space, which is amazing. So in Vietnam, <laughs> they had small ones on helicopters and shit, and planes. And, and they just, just like, dropping them? Oh, my God. Like, they, they'd shoot, like, hundreds at a time and just, like, carpet bomb, like, a jungle. Jesus. It's just everyone, like, it's I kind of fucking dude, people. I kind of wish I can go back in time and, like, third-person view from, like, maybe, like, an aerial fucking view, like, a nice, uh, I don't even know. I'm just witnessing all this shit. I would love to do that if I could time travel. Bro, or like I go or see like it. or go see like <laughs> I would not do that for a second just to see that's like that's terrifying it's the past it already yeah. happened so just go and see it you know what but I'm dude, saying you'd like, be like what the dude, what? fuck the that's so much death no if it was just like like I don't know you're saying they were dropping it in the fucking like jungle yeah I want to see that jungle disappear dude yeah. like uh, that would be cool as fuck well no it'd go like through the brush and shit but if there were people down there, oh yeah, <laughs> that, do that. oh yeah, it would just yeah, Super I know. Bad, but yeah. or imagine that's what, I was, that's what I would be thinking about though. But imagine like going back in time, third person view, and you are watching <laughs> Genghis Khan's fucking army destroy another army. Dude, yeah, that'd be sweet. But then I would also be seeing de- people killing other people. It'd be just I, like the movies. Probably traumatized. No, that's like too cl- too real, man. I feel like there's a. Fuck, dude. Yeah, what do you think? Please set your feelings aside, dude. Stop being a puss for just a sec, man, and just be a man. Would you want to see that shit? It would be crazy. That would be crazy. It would be awesome. And you fucking, if you were listening to that podcast and you were saying how tactical Genghis Khan's army was, yeah. Apparently, he just shot on it. Yeah, that's what does. Unless you're like talking about Russia, because he just sucks Russia's dick, because he's uh, Armenian. Yeah, he's Armenian. Who L- 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 oh, uh, uh, TJ, uh, oh, Neil. Uh, Tupac. Yeah, Tupac, dad. Dad mouth? <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. No. Anyways, TJ? man. Okay, so if you could go back in time, right? Yeah. Top three. Top three, like, or if you could time travel, you know? All right, yeah. Top three, would you go Moments. in the future, in the back? What would you see? Top three. Oh. Do you want to actually... Holocaust? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> no, dude. I no, want to see. I'm like, kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, like, uh, dude, I would want to be in Sarajevo during like World War, like right before World War. Oh, as so you can see, fucking our dude Fernandes. Fernandes. Like, oh, that's dude, cool. that's the most like coincident, like dental, like thing that's ever happened in history. Dude, and it caused the craziest. Yeah, I wish I could go back in that time to that and, time. Yeah. And then yeah. Like, come on, wait, wait. I'll, I'll, try to tell him, I'll like, stop, you. everyone, stop, yeah, stop. I, He's helping. He wants to free you. He like, there's but, no need to kill him. No, no, He's no, on like, your side. Well, that would be the smart thing to do. But, like, <laughs> no, you're not. You're not helping out the crowd. No, but like right before Gavrilo Princep shoots him, I'd like, I'd like come in there and I'd like stop it. <laughs> And I'd be like, hey, stop it. And I'd detain him and all that stuff. Uh-huh. They'd be like, wow, thanks. would <laughs> be like... <laughs> 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 That's my credit, bitch. So you take the credit for shooting Arctic France for an That's crazy. And I just like, time travel back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not bitch. <laughs> what the fuck happened? Imagine Dan Carlin telling that story. <laughs> In a world. <laughs> that was love it. Hardcore history. <laughs> where, else would, where else would you go? Would you, ever, would you go in the future at all? Yeah, man, I would, I would like to see like I, I would like to see like where it develops like space, because I feel like eventually it has to. What do you think is gonna happen? Just because our resources are gonna well, we unless we die space? before, literally unless we die before, that's the only way we're not only way we're not gonna go to space. When when do they say that we're supposed to run out of like resource like like natural uh, resources? Like what? Like uh like oil and coal and stuff like that? Then like don't no, they have like a prediction on when like we're just gonna run out? I think there's a lot of fucking resources now. I think we're probably good for a while. Also, hey, for our generation, hey, we're good. You know hey. what I'm saying? We're good. Hey, there's, there's a lot of oil under the United States and stuff. We yeah. just don't drill it because it's all protected and stuff. Yeah, we drill Middle East. Yeah, we have them fuck their environment up and just ship it to us. 
And they're super rich for now. That's nice. And for now. to the future, we will own Dubai. <laughs> we will. Well, that's what happened in Venezuela, is that they had a lot, they have a ton of oil. That's all. So that's the only thing they depended on. Their commie retard president came in. Mm-hmm. I think Chavez was before him. And Chavez. Yeah. yeah, and they like kind of didn't sell a lot of oil. The new guy came in and just sold all the oil. And now they're like the, super The price poor. is tanked. Yeah. And now it's like worthless because like Russia has cheaper oil and all that stuff. So now they're just poor. Yep. That's literally it. It's so awful, man. Yeah. Also communist. Yeah. Uh, it happens. Communist. <laughs> they're socialists. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's like... Not yeah, the same. government took over all the oil companies and then started selling all this oil, making all this money, and then the price of oil dropped. Mm. So then they made no money throughout the entire... There's no jobs, there's nothing, there's no economy. Yeah, people are starving, man. RuneScape money is worth more than Venezuelan money. Wow. Yeah, there's people in Are you Venezuela, fucking serious? They play RuneScape to get, to get money. <laughs> <laughs> they, sell it, they sell accounts online, probably. No, they go in there and they sell RuneScape gold. <laughs> Yeah, and they uh, use the currency. <laughs> well, that's what that's what I was saying. They probably like make the money like on the <laughs> accounts, and they probably like sell the accounts they trade to people, the right? Money. No, you don't have to sell the account. But people will people in RuneScape they they hate them, and they they have like Venezuelan death squads where they'll oh go go find the Venezuelan players and try and kill them. I had no idea about that. That's fucking insane. Yeah, but it's really funny. <laughs> <laughs> that is super funny. That that's Damn. great. Damn, Venezuela, that's great. dude, just fucking oh leave the God. place. Yeah. Might as well just turn that place into a tourist like, like country. Like, what or the fuck? Or do have no money. <laughs> yeah. You know? Nobody wants to invest in some place they like need that. To, like, it's unstable kill now. Communes. Just kill all the communists. Dude, it's so unstable now. Like, mm-hmm. What are the children going to do? What are the children going to do? What children? They're, they all got ate by their parents. <laughs> That's fucked up. <laughs> what happens in Congress? That's too much. Jesus Christ. That's happened. That happened in the yeah. USSR. Yeah, it did. They I mean, ate the children? I mean, dude. Always lies about that, dude. They had, they had human farms. Yeah, he said like their doctors were like the most paid doctors in the world. I was like, yeah. they literally weren't. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, he, not he, in that country. Maybe if they left that you know, USSR yeah. somewhere else, they'd get paid a lot. I was pretty crazy with that. He just likes defending Russia because he's from that shit country. But he's not even from it. That's the thing. Well, I thought he was born there. No, he's where. In his country. He was born in America, bro. Oh, he was? First of all, he was born in America. Wait, he has identity. He bro. has, he, he's, yeah, America, he was born in America. That his ethnicity, that. like, he, or whatever the f- heck. That we, have Ar- a, we have an Armenian friend, so this is who we're talking about. He, he's Armenian, right? Yeah. And, like, he has no Russian fucking ties, bro. His yeah. his grandfather fought in World War One and or two, one and two probably. Yeah, probably for the for the USSR, and that's the only connection he has with the USSR. Yeah. Well, he just because because he's like I'm from Armenia. Everyone's like that's fucking gay. Where's but the, he's like oh, I'm from. That's I'm fucking gay. <laughs> <laughs> he's like I'm Russian, and they're like wow, that's cool and interesting like so he just like associates with that that nearby country more yeah and he like just sucks their dick i don't know why it's weird he has not i think he has identity problems he has a lot of uh brain issues I think. <laughs> what <laughs> was an active viewer say hey salam yeah assalamu alaikum brother we have to cut all that out because like we Oh no, we're keeping all that in. Details. no we're keeping all that in sir no, we're keeping all that, bo- that little boy in Give me a, give me a time mark on it right now. What's it looking like? Forty three minutes. Um, the, How you feel, man? I feel great, man. I feel really energetic. I feel really like you know enthusiastic right now. I feel like I'm about to throw I up. I feel happy. Um, I feel like I'm about to throw up. Why? <laughs> if you're gonna throw up, I'm gonna throw up. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Can you drink some water? It's just yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping it would fall on my so lap. Hard. I didn't. I knew that was gonna happen. That's why I just didn't put my hands up. I was just. I was ready for it. That's Thank so you. Fucking hard. I'm fucking hard. You wish you were hard. You how, dude? How fucking high do you think I can get it with like in my mouth? Well, I mean, it would. Some of it would go in your mouth. <laughs> yeah. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> Fuck. That was really fast. <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Do you remember the office? Oh, uh, yeah. Remember when Michael Scott was like training? And he's like, <laughs> and he spit everywhere. <laughs> he's like, this. 
<laughs> that was gold. I'm sorry, Chris. Yeah. Now you miss. It's good. I'm sorry, oh, Chris. You spit on me a lot that one day, and then I got sick. Dude, I'm. I got you. Spit on me three times that day. I got no. you sick. I got you sick. Yeah. Did you? Yeah. I didn't care. Dude. Cause you smoked. I was so fucking sick. I, I'm just now getting over like my sickness because I was down with the sickness. Get up, get down with the sickness. Ooh, wah. <laughs> yeah, <I'm okay>. Ooh, <laughs> wah. Oh wah! Oh wah! Do no no, do no 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 no! Oh oh! That's my shit, dude. What? Nothing. Anyways, wah. let's fucking get to these Tinder pictures. Oh yeah, right? oh yeah. Let's get to that. All right. Oh my god. I mean, uh, they're my favorite. Okay. That's my favorite thing to do. All right. This is my. Right here. See, that's the main one right there, okay? That's pretty good. That's the main one. You know, it's just me. I have a mustache. It's a little weird. You're looking directly into the camera, but it's all right. Oh, yeah, because I, I, I set it up. You know what I'm saying? So I, I wanted to do that. This next one is me crying <laughs> because I'm an emotional man. So yeah. just so people know, you know what I'm talking about? So these yeah, bitches know. This much. is my black friend. I don't care that, you know, I mean, it's not important that he's black, but it, you know what I'm saying? It's worth mentioning. This is me smiling because sometimes I, you know, I'm not always depressed. I'm not always depressed. And, you know, I like to smile sometimes. And then the young thug meme, <laughs> him flicking off a Minecraft character. That's a good one. See, how am I not getting bitches, dude? Th like, this is quality, like, 10, this is right? comedy gold. You got 10, right? And I'm tan. Girls and don't you're tan. have good senses of humor, really. So oh, absolutely. Was, so that's the that's the worst fucking part. It's, I'm not gonna find my love of my life, but like, nah. I'd want to get matches so I can fuck with them. You know what I'm saying? I could, I could be like, hey, can I suck your toes or some shit? You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> I love getting like an like a reaction out of like out of the girls, cause that's the fun part about Tinder. I don't go on Tinder. I'm like, I want to search for love. You do that. Kill yourself. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, that's not what what it's for. It's never. That's really what it's isn't. never. It's literally just get your dick sucked or get your. You can find love on Tinder. Nah, dude. Nah, nah, nah dude. No, nah, man. Nah, dude. Why not? Nah, nah, dude. It's not gonna work out. Nah. It might. It might be okay right now. Your relationship might be all right, but if you, you match with somebody on Tinder, eventually, you're gonna break up. Well, yeah, most people. Break up. I don't know. It's, it's pretty but good. like, uh, you don't think people found the love of their life on uh, Tinder? It's just statistically, they have, have to, have to, have to, have to. So, um, nah, what about, what about nah. your sponsor? Oh yeah, um, do you? Yeah, here. You should. You we'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it together. Right. Here, zoom in. Zoom in. Zoom the camera in on me and, and uh. All right, that's it. Yep, you're good. Do you know who our sponsor is? Some cookie lady. Right? Is, is Taylor, Taylor's baked cookie. Hey, she has an inter inter interracial boyfriend. Yes, he's black and as fuck. I've met him. He oh, is we, black Actually, yeah, we all fuck. we all met him. And he's cool. A, he's a good-ass yeah, fucking guy. Um, guy. Check out our sponsor, Taylor's Baked Goods. She's on Instagram. She's slacking with the fucking website. Make the website! Say it in the mic. Make the... Make the website. Love you, Taylor. But listen, you had a website, it'd be easier to direct people to your stuff. Okay? You gotta really make that website. You gotta pick up the fucking slack, woman. You gotta make right? that website. Listen, your boyfriend might beat my ass for yelling at you right now. He should beat your ass. Wake up! <sighs> it's time to make a website. Like check, out Taylor's, check out Taylor's Baked Goods. On Instagram, she makes a bunch of baked goods. Literally, that's what it is. You like sweet stuff in your mouth? I do. I love it. When was the last time you ate? Two days. Ten ago? days ago. Fast for five days. At a at time. A, at a time. Straight. Yeah. I starve my body, but purify my soul. Tell them to go check out Taylor's baked goods. On check. Instagram. Yeah. What's her name? Taylor. What's her name? Check Taylor. That's like a unisex name. It could be either a guy or a boy's name. Taylor. Here, let's do. Let's check do, out Taylor's big good. Here, let's do an acapella right now. All right, let's do it. Bottom. Ba ah. Bottom. Ba ah. Bottom. Ba ah. Bottom. Big goods. Bottom. Big goods. Check her out on Instagram because she has awesome bakers on her page. If you don't do, I'm gonna hit you in the face. Might whip out my dick and slap you in the face with it. Totally. Respect.
It was back. I was tight. Did my face red? I was tight. No. Dude, I am so hot. <laughs> it's so hot. I, feel like. I feel like I'm radiating heat. I'm also like... You're, you, know, you are, you because you're energetic. You know when you like... When you go outside and you're sitting in your car? It's, leather doesn't fucking help, man. That's... Leather doesn't Yeah, you gotta get a new car, man. You gotta just throw out that old one. And... I will never buy a car that doesn't have leather seats, man. Are you serious? Because, like, leather looks so much fucking nicer. And, like, all the cars I want have leather. <laughs> what kind of cars, like, are super, like, luxurious that don't have leather? None, because, no, like, nobody wants that. But it's garbage. It stupid but it's super hot in the summer. It's the stickiest well, that's shit. That's why you have it's drivers. Really the... But nobody has fucking drivers. <laughs> <laughs> that's, why you drivers. <laughs> that's why you have drivers, but nobody has fucking drivers. Nobody has drivers. Unless you're baller class. Like, I don't even know what class you need to be in, ball- but to be baller class. I just want a fucking dirt bike, dude. Why are you just buy one, dude? They're not that expensive. Because I want to be able to, like, ride them, like, everywhere, but I can't ride in it everywhere. You can definitely buy one for, like, a couple hundred bucks. I can fix go. one up. Fix one up? Yeah, it's just, I'm just going to fix a motorcycle. <laughs> like, I don't even ride one, but I'll <laughs> fix one. <laughs> I can't even change my oil. I'm going to fix a motorcycle up. Dude. Yo, don't stop hating on his abilities, bro. He can I'm fix not. it. You can fix it. I can't change my oil. I just go to the fucking mechanic and he hooks me up. Like go, 20 uh, bucks. You, go, you, don't go, you don't go to a mechanic. You go to Jiffy Lube. I, do, I don't go to Jiffy Lube. You go to Jiffy Lube. He yeah. goes to fucking Jiffy Lube. I go to a super Muslim uh, mechanic That's from true. Vietnam, bro. He's my, Muslim from Vietnam? Yeah. What the fuck happened to him? I don't know. He got, he lo- he got lost. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it was. He, he got lost. He escaped the jungle. That's what he did. And then found God. Islamic in, God. In the jungle. He, he found the fake God. Fake God. Basically. Pretend God. One of the gods. Anyway, Salam. Would you rather be a pagan or a Muslim? I'd rather kill myself. Pagan. <laughs> I would totally be like a Viking pagan. Fuck yeah, dude. dude. Our people were pagans, bro. But the pagan shit's way cool. I know. Because like, they got Halloween and like every holiday. What? Yeah, every holiday's like pagan. Really? Yeah. Like... Can because you? the Christians wanted to convert all the pagans to Christianity, so oh. they checked in their holidays. Be like, hey, it's not so different, guys. It's going to be easy. Yeah, just check, I don't jump on board. have to genocide y'all, but, you know. We will if we have to. Let's make it easier. <laughs> make it easier on Christmas, you. it's a pagan holiday. Yeah. Well, it's just pagan. Yeah, man. I had no idea. I had no idea. Dude, you know what song I was listening to today? And it made me dance like fucking crazy? I'm about to play it. I was dancing this morning. Is it Kuso Rare? I don't think this song has ever made me dance. It's always never made me dance. You can't pick that <laughs> That's such a garbage <laughs> song, bro. I mean, they might let it because it's such a shit song. <laughs> they literally might let it because how garbage the song is. Can you zoom in on the sweat beat on my forehead? Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, you are really sweaty, man. You're like, what do you want me to say? You're glistening. We're, there's three dudes in this you're, small ass little stew. But bro, you're he t- says the fucking AC is on. <laughs> it's not. It's just probably a low. That you that shit fucking got absorbed or something. All right, fine. Forget it, man. Just forget it. Forget it. This isn't fun anymore. Oh, uh, dude. All uh, right. Have you seen that? All right. Let's talk about something. Let's talk about uh, Alaskan bush people, and. I want to. I want to go in depth into this. That needs to be its own fucking show, dude. That is the greatest fucking thing on planet, man. Like, I watched one episode and I was already hooked. Oh my god, dude! I, I'm so hooked, dude. I watched. Ent- I'm almost through the entire first season. It's literally about these like this this inbred family. It, it is what it is, guys. They're inbred. It's an inbred family. Are you sure? Not yet. Not yet. I'm not. I'm not that sure yet. It will be in the future for sure. Oh, 100. percent They don't leave the freaking woods. They probably live in the life, man. Yeah, or they, or they're not. <laughs> they're, they're digging goddamn hip hip holes and goddamn uh, head, holes. head holes. Get the hell out of here, bro! They literally don't even have sleeping bags. They were sleeping in the dirt. What the fuck kind of shit is that, dude? Yeah, like they don't want building a log cabin. But bro, fucking get a sleeping bag. Goddamn digging it's a hip hole. It's hard. You, sleeping bags cost money, and they've God. never had. Yeah, job. they're like they're all super they unemployed. No God, money. I hate them so much. They're bro. all super unemployed. God damn it! I love Don't have like stuff. seven kids too, bro. Like holy shit! They're, like, you know who gives them money? Like how the hell do they get money? Remember when they were, remember the mom was cutting away, up the right? potatoes? Uh, how how they get money? They barter. 
They don't barter shit. Yeah, Who the hell wants chop. anything from them? They say, hey, I'll give you some shit if you chop this wood. My sons will come work for you. For I got four that- strong boys. I'll come over there and okay. chop some wood. Okay, okay, okay. He did say that. He did say, I got I got four I got four sons. I'm, uh, uh, sir, sir, I really need this wood. All right, so he needed to get this wood in order to build a fucking house. Yeah. And he only had $5,000. The wood cost $10,000. He essentially takes this man, he was talking to this man by the bar, he takes this man aside, and he starts telling him this, oh, I'm a piece of shit. <laughs> like, off camera, this is off camera, I'm a piece of shit. I can't afford to give my my, my, my family a cabin made out of wood, so I've been using tarps and shit. My goddamn mentally challenged sons are making hip, hip holes and head holes. Like, this, my, my one son, he doesn't know even how to uh, walk places. He just runs everywhere. His name is Bear. He literally just fucking starts sprinting wherever he wa- goes. Dude, he's so fast. Dude, it's fucking nonsense. He literally does that. There's He has a son that he says, oh, I'm Bear. I, I don't like, I, I, while other people walk, I run places or some shit like that. He literally runs wherever he goes. While others walk, Bear runs. And one of his powers is like... I'm also... Ex- it's like a fucking cult. I was thinking about this I, other I'm night. I'm the extreme one in my family. When you can also get hard walk, whenever he I runs. I like to run. That's what... Why walk? I always say, why walk? When you can just run everywhere. That's what he fucking sounds like. <laughs> I swear to God. No, I shouldn't get around. He literally sounds like that. I know it sounds awful. Watch the show. Like, and like yeah, fucking just watch the show. It's an amazing show. I highly recommend it. You know how he hits on girls? Oh um, my god. How do you get on a girl? He sits down, he goes, how do you meet a girl, first of all? They, go, they go into town. They go into oh, town wow. one of the episodes. It's amazing, man. Hello. I, hey, hey, girls, I'm Bear Brown. I, you guys like to climb trees? When was the last time you climbed a tree? God damn. I climbed a tree this morning. I would have been like, dude, have you been living... <laughs> That's living- exactly what he says. I, I, the first, thing in my, first thing that pops in my mind, I'd be like, dude, have you been living in isolation for fucking ever, dude? What, what is wrong with you? Yes, yes, he has. You know the fuck this thing? I watched this whole second season, and... Did they get less mentally challenged? Act- no, no, that pickup line, like, actually worked. Did it? Point. Yeah. What the fuck? Dude, but it, dude, dude, it's that's a great how you know, show. That's how you know it's the a great show. show. That, no, that's how you know the show is fake. But get I, the fuck out of here! That pickup line. Oh, hey guys, I run and I climb trees. Yeah, <laughs> oh my god! Oh, <laughs> you run? Oh, you, you, climb, can. you can climb a tree? Oh. You're gonna think that they're all. You think they, they that have, show is so fake? Dude. Oh my god, the oh, other side. That shit's as fake as fucking moonshiners. But they, that show is amazing, bro. Oh, bro, the, my my other favorite. There's more characters. There's more characters in the show. One of them is Bam Bam. He's a twenty-eight year old. Uh, he he he's a very handsome young man. Let's let's be honest. Oh. I don't know about that, but they're, all, they're all old as shit. But one of them is tw- like there's one that's twenty-eight. The one is thirty, but like the twenty-eight year old literally uh, just no the thirty-year-old fucks with that one kid, the vampire kid, dude. Oh. That so the guy has a vampire, yeah, crippled vampire kid. He hurt his leg and he just walks around with a fucking cane <laughs> and he always like acts like a vampire wherever he fucking goes. Yeah, he's, he's a man. And, like, a yeah, and, and literally that one kid, <laughs> dude, the normal brother, literally just fucks with him all the time. A fucking trench coat, ready yeah, to just like so flash funny. people. You no, know, like, like he like uh, recites poetry to girls. Yeah, damn, like, like, that's fucking real. You have like the blue bluest eyes I've ever seen. They're like the ocean, and they make me want to cry. Wow. And then, he's, can I have the phone number? Oh, <laughs> uh, you can have the store's phone <laughs> number. <laughs> That's oh just go, bro. He goes outside. His brother's like, "I got her phone number." He's like, "You don't even have a phone." He's like, you have a payphone out in front of the store. It's like, go to the payphone and call the store. That's funny God, as hell, dude. man. Dude. dude, it's a great show. I highly recommend it. It's amazing. I can't I watched, stop I watched, complimenting it, dude. I watched a real good show on History Channel. Yeah, where it's like these dudes. I might have told you this before. These dudes go out, <clears throat> uh-huh. and they have, like, a wood shop. Well, I guess, like, whatever blacksmiths have, like, I guess their little, like, workshop. Yeah. Foundry. Maybe. Well, Foundry. these dudes, they have to make a weapon, st- like, from scratch. And then, like, these, like, judges yeah. are dudes that just have to, like, like you know, hit those fake-ass gelatin bodies. And I just love, you know, when they oh, have, like, the really? fucking blood is, inside and shit. Oh, that's sick. And they're, like, and they test the durability and whatnot. And one of the judges was, like, a green beret. Like, was, like, a professional killer. So he's just, like... Shoo, shoo. <laughs> so he'd be, like... Ah, ah, and then stab, too. And then be, like... 
You know what I mean? <laughs> don't it's like shanking. Yeah, don't this fucking, is the shanking method. And they, they have like shanking, it's like strength, durability, like how like you know fucking nice it was like using it. Like that, dude. It's a great ass fucking What's the show. Name of it? Well, I'll look it up. It was on the History Channel. When I was watching my friend's house, I was like in his living room. It sounds, no offense. It sounds familiar to like that, that one show. That show sounds fucking stupid. Dude, listen. <laughs> yeah, have you ever stupid. watched like like Warrior vs. Warrior shit that on Spike? Sure. Have you ever seen those videos of like people taking like swords and like hitting cardboard boxes and shit? That, that's like <laughs> a level <laughs> up. That's a level up from that. Yeah, it's just like higher production quality. Yeah. It's on, it's on History Channel. Forged in Fire. That's what it's Forged called. Forged in Fire. Dude, it's 8.4 out of 10 on IMDb. It doesn't mean shit. Dude, it's a great ass show. Dude, ch- I'm telling you, if you ch- watched right, it, right, you would wait. love it. All right, check what uh, like Ready Player One is on IMDb and like the, the, some of the other shit. Like, what's Star Wars on IMDb? The new one? Yeah. It's probably, it's probably like a between a five and a six. Like, there's no way. Damn, it has a six point seven point six. Uh, out of ten, <laughs> on Rotten Tomatoes. That's no. too high. No, that's Ready Player One. Oh. And that's it also too high. Ha- it also has that's a seventy-three percent on that Rotten Tomatoes. That movie was garbage. Ready yeah. Player One. Was... That's your opinion. Yeah, that's my opinion. But that's right. your opinion, it was right, sir. Man. Sir, it was right. It was a garbage movie, man. Like the end, they all start gathering together. Like, hooray! We did it. Listen. We saved the planet by giving it to everyone. Dude, it was, really talk- was it like a virtual reality kind yeah, of movie? Yeah, it was, but like the the way the end happened, literally a crowd of people started. Spoiler sur- alert! Sur- yeah, spoiler alert! <laughs> a group of people started surrounding a fucking truck. Essentially, I, I don't give and you guys the, enough context and to then figure the truck it out. Explodes! It's just nonsense. <laughs> like the, everybody dies. It's just like everyone join together to fight the comet. Dude, that won't ever fucking happen. That's just nonsense. I mean, if I can be Iron Giant. You it's know. just like a stupid storyline, man. It was just like, I don't know. Dude, have you ever watched like The Iron Giant? Yeah, like a thousand times. Dude. That was good. That movie's so odd if you think about it. How's it odd? Uh, I don't understand why people are so into it it's now. It's like a science fiction Norman I, Rockwell picture. Bro, I liked it when I was like a kid. It's odd, but it's amazing, though. Yeah, I don't like why it's people... so odd. But why do people You're like this? a child. <laughs> That's a good point. But he doesn't know. Dude, there was this one like scene. There was this one scene. I, remember, I watched it recently. And you know when, like, he goes to the woods and, like, there's a big-ass, like, chunk taken out of the woods? He's like, whoa, what the <laughs> fuck happened here? That's just scary. You know what I mean? That's just terrifying. What? And, fucking saw that in the forest. <laughs> and he saw, like, the trees move, and you're like, oh, my God, what's coming? So he starts running away, and there was one one point when he gets away, finally, like, you know, he's riding his bike down the hill, and the Iron Giant's just looking at him. Mm-hmm. At one point, like, the camera goes on his face, and it's just like, I'm gonna fucking get you, motherfucker. Yeah. Terrifying. But then he eventually turns out to be just a pet. He, yeah. he turns into literally a house pet. Then he's like our and then his little hand, his hand disconnects and he fucking hangs out in the house yeah, with the little boy. Hilarious. It's just a retarded robot. He's like, because you see everything. <laughs> yeah, remember? He didn't get retarded. He got like he didn't hit really his head, so he's like, he's like, I can't go home. Yeah, you got a I can't go home. But dude, that's such an old ass movie. That's good. It's I love good, it. Though. It's- Fucking, <gasps> Dude, I'm saying if we watch it again, yeah, I would love it would, even more. We would just laugh at it so hard because it's well, just I'd funny. Laugh at it it's is it funny? Balls. Yeah, but it's so. funny. Oh man, stop it! We would destroy it comedically. Really? Yes. Because really that crazy? I destroyed it myself. Like, let's my watch head. it. It's fucking That's hilarious. Bad, oh no, I, it's amazing. I do because I loved it because it made me laugh. You know, it was pretty, and it was pretty like you know wholesome, oh, you, heartwarming. You, you were laughing at the end, like when he dies. Yeah. <laughs> Why? No. Spoiler, bro. You didn't. You didn't love that. You didn't grow to love Vin Diesel's character. Dude, that's right. Vin Diesel was the fucking Iron Giant. Yeah. Was he? No wonder yeah, he got Groot, bro. That's why he got Groot. Yeah, probably is. That's probably why he got Groot. He probably gets. He gets paid so much money. He's like, dude, what are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. He's not just show up to set. He doesn't do anything. Dude, those Vin Diesel memes that you kept on sending me were like yeah, killing. They're me. not even memes. They're just the actual shit he would post on. Okay, Facebook. so check that out. That's another thing. Hey, Everyone Vin needs Diesel's to check out. super fucking odd. Dude, he's a very he's, weird person. He's so weird. I didn't realize how weird he is. I think he has a good sense of humor. Oh yeah, he's, he's awesome. It's hilarious. He's an advanced humor. Dude, it's so funny. Yeah, it go to Vin Diesel's Facebook, go to his photos, and go as far back as you can, about 2010, 2012. You're going to love everyone. Just 
See what you find there. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a treasure it's trove. It's really a fucking gold mine. It really is a treasure it's trove. It's a gold man. mine, dude. Like a 911 one. 9-11 one. That's exactly <laughs> what I was thinking, bro. Dude. I was thinking about that 911 one. Don't cry about 911. And it's him like yeah. it's him like doing the uh like like him just praying. Like, yeah, like oh Jesus, 911. You know, like, do you ever do that Christian thing when you go like this? <laughs> and salam alaikum. Yeah, as alaikum. Right, right left. Right left. Yeah. Does it matter? Yeah, it matters. Did you hear that? My stomach was running. Are you hungry? No. I am. Sounded like a kid. I, w- I ate a child. Could you eat a child if you had to, dude? Like, could you eat your own child if you were like? Oh Jesus! Oh, I mean, That's a question to ask right there. Oh well, yeah, because I had to. So sorry, kid. If sorry, you, buckaroo. But like, what, what would do? Would you cut your arm off and like have it for a meal for you and your child? If it came down to that. But you didn't want to kill your like kid because he was like, dude, that's because you know he's gonna shit. go, you know he's gonna go D one because he's like super fucking fit, dude. He's like five years old and he already has like an eight pack for some reason, oh, okay. right? And you're like, damn, I really don't want to fucking eat my <laughs> well, kid, I'd dude. I have to eat him because if he's that, like, he's a threat to me at that point. Eventually, he's gonna have to eat me. Yeah, he gets he's strong. Down, so I'm gonna have to eat him first dude, before he comes down. He will get stronger. But he's five. I don't care. I mean, I feel like you can. I, I want to live. He'll poison Shit. me. Who wants to live? Does he? How is? I don't know. He could try and stop me and kill me. It depends on how strong his little live is. And how he, clever he is. Do you think you can outrun a child? Definitely. Yeah. Not. We're, Definitely we're, not. How old? Like six. Yeah, I could outrun the shit out of a child. Are you sure? Yeah. No. Are fine. you, pu- dude? I've seen some fast ass fucking children, man. I did too, bro. And, and especially like, like your cousin, dude. Yeah, you were not. Kitchen. I was like, he's not his, six. his little cousin was so fast when he was like young. Yeah, bro. He's, not he's like 14. Right? Yeah, no, I'm he's saying when, slow he, was, when, he was, when he was young. That guy's super slow. He's, no. super, he's slow as me. Right like, now? Probably. He's our, a little like, faster. He's more agile. Like yeah. twice as far as theirs. Do you see how fast I run? You know, I run fast. Oh, do you? You want to have a what? race? You want to have a race? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's I'll, do it. What are you, a six-year-old? Like, what is are we going to have a do? foot race? Yeah, let's have a foot, foot race. Dude, race! I remember in elementary in school, at the end of recess, every fucking day at the end of recess, everybody would have to get on the line and run and see who the fastest was. Yeah. And there was this kid, Dimitri, and this kid, TJ. His name was Tyler. Everybody called him TJ. And they were all super fucking athletic. Mm-hmm. Dimitri didn't know how to speak English. He was just a fast-ass Russian. You know, he was in ESL with me. So, like, him and I just knew him. We both just were stupid as fuck as kids. Him and TJ would always be, like, first and, like, second, like, you know, either, like, they'd be vice versa all the time, and I would always be third. So, I was fucking fast as shit, dude, as a child. And then you just, like, slow the fuck down, bro. What the fuck happened? I got fat. Mass. And I, my ass? Mass. You want to eat my ass? Mass. <laughs> <laughs> nah, dude, it's cool. I've gained it. I do. I did gain a lot of weight. I still need to fucking lose weight, though. No, you're good now. Just you're good yeah, see, you're good now. Yeah, you're fine. You look red as fuck, dude. You look red as hell. Well, it's because I'm hot, you're dude. Like fucking Native American. Is that a bad thing, Chris? Dude, I found this patch. My mom actually found this patch. It's yes. like, I'm, I'm about to like put it on my fucking jean shorts. Yeah. It's, it's just a red thing. skin. Wow. Literally, it's like a Native American. His face is like blood red. I'm like oh, super fuck. racist, but like, I'm going to put that on my fucking jean shorts. Because it looks like a soccer patch you can just wear. Is, is, is it a soccer patch? No. It's an Indian person's face. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's just super racist. It's, it's just like it's a, a super racist. Clan, uh... I don't know, loves it, though. It's for style, people. Dude. Just for style. Where'd your mom get it? Jesus. I have no idea. She was like, I found this. I was like, oh, sick. And I looked at it later. I'm like, oh, this is super fucking racist. Probably some hate group dropped it while they were throwing rocks at your house. Dude. Don't fucking say that. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to say it again. Do you want me to say it again? Yeah, it's cool. It's Muslim funny, people. It's true. I Dude. had KKK deliver some KKK shit to my door once. What was really? it? Yeah. KKK said hello to me once. What they, they deliver? Super chill. Like they were they, nice. They dropped shit off. My my my, my like, parents weren't very respectful to them. Hey guys, we're the local KKK. Let's keep America white and stuff. We're Muslim, <laughs> so <laughs> have like a nice the news thing. and shit. Like. They're probably really cool guys. I know that I know they wanted to like uh, do like a march in New Cumberland or something like that. They should. Would you join? I might if they're that cool. Uh, how <laughs> cool, how cool could they possibly be though? I don't know. If they let me join, they're probably pretty fucking cool. <laughs> well, they let literally anyone join. 
No, no, well, no. I don't know about that. Ask some of. Hey, there's some people that we know that they would definitely not let join. Like who? No, because he's because he's Christian. Oh, he's, well, yeah, true. Or what Christian? I feel like Christian might join. Christian's probably like if he's if, dedicated. If they didn't let him join, it's just because they're uh, they're afraid of him because he's too intelligent. He'd become like the king or the KKK. Dude, they're so stupid. They're all fucking stupid. <laughs> it's like inbred people. It's literally like, like really cool guys. They need to do a lot. They need to do like a discovery show on the KKK where they just follow them around while they do stupid shit. Yeah, that'd be good. Oh, that'd, that'd be a good idea. There you do. Duck Dynasty. Yeah, Duck Dynasty. <laughs> <laughs> no, those guys are super cool. They're just like normal neocons. Oh, What's a neocon? Crazy. It's so hot in here now, dude. I'm feeling it. It's on my skin. You want a hug? No, you're 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 like radiating heat. If on you me. guys embrace, it'll cool you both off, dude. You'll swap. Uh, this was a great idea. Yeah, this wasn't like planned out. My friend wasn't supposed to be with me, but it worked so, out. It's just great, you know. This is our second guest on the podcast. Our first one was Neil. 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 Say it with us. Neil. Neil down before me. For I am your king, and I shall rule the earth one day with such great power that I shall kill every single one of you with all my might and power. Get it all out. Sorry. Neil. Neil. Who you've already outed. I channeled my inner Hitler for that one, dude. That was good. I heard the German and Austrian. Yes, boots and crowds and boots and crowds, sauerkraut in my puss. Who's Hitler? Hitler, dude, here, I'll, I'll inform you about a man called Hitler. This man came down to earth and uh, he said when he was a child, I don't like Jewish people. I don't like Jewish people. People are like, why? Why don't you like Jewish people, sir? <laughs> He's like, I fucking hate them. So people just were like, oh, my God, I guess this guy just doesn't like Jewish people. And they didn't think anything of it. This guy's just crazy. And then later on, the man turns into a dictator. Holocaust happens. What's put that? the cam- Put the camera on. Holocaust happens. Children die. Men die. Women die. Fuck off. Wow. Someone should stop that guy. He's laughing about children dying. Hey man, it's in the past. You know what happened in the past? It's, it's just the, a statistic. It's just in the past. You actually, Dan Carlin has said that at a point in time, there it, people. Ah, oh, fuck. That's a, this is a. Edo's face is just distracting me on this one. I love the zoom effects, dude. <laughs> so, I've never been shirtless yet for this podcast. It's fucking great. Yeah, I, someone should stop that guy. Stop who? Hitler. Yeah, he's a bad guy, man. You know, Farouk? He's not really chill about anything. I was hanging out with Farouk. What a dork. Hold on, let me wipe my sweat. Oh, Cool Farouk or Gay Farouk? Cool Farouk. Oh, okay. All right. I was hanging out with Cool Farouk. Are you are you that one on, on? He watches your fucking shit a lot. <laughs> That's fine. All right. Yeah. Who? Who? Gay Farouk. Oh, yeah. That's fine. <laughs> but, like, oh, Cool crazy. Farouk, he was like, dude, I just don't like Indians. I was like, what? He's like, yeah, man, I fucking hate him. I was like, That's crazy. And I was like, you know, this is just how, like, Hitler was when he was a kid. You know, everybody, he was just like, I fucking hate Jewish people. And then people are like, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? And I'm, Farouk's going to be the next fucking Hitler, and he's just going to terminate Indian people. I know at least three, four, including my dad, people that just, like, don't like Indian people. Who? Oh, I'm not going to name any names uh. besides my dad. But, uh, Dude, your dad's so hot. Well, it's not that he doesn't like him. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, not, it's not that he doesn't like him. It's yeah. just that they piss him off. Yeah. You know, he's, like, trying to rip him off and, like, get free shit, which, I mean... I, I, yeah, I mean, people barter, like, you know, in foreign countries too much. And then they come here and they're like, hey, man, do you think I can just, like, get this drink that's, like, a certified price? I can't just get it for, like, $2 less? Like, hey, yo, I, I don't come in your fucking convenience store and try and barter. Whoa, whoa, dude. Well, that was uh, not very PC of you right there. Oh, uh, but it's fucking true. That's PC it? back one It's, here. like, literally 100% true. No, that's true. Uh, we, can go, we can go film a podcast in an Indian... Shop. I shot a movie in a convenience store run by Indians. 
Really? What, yeah. Did they he say it you? was okay? Yeah, they're real cool. I had my Indian friend uh, barter with them. <laughs> barter with, with them. He bartered with them. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I didn't he gave him three like, gold yeah, rubies. He bought some shit, but like. Okay. Okay. Do you want to. Tamal, like, what Indian are they? I don't know. Okay. I, they, I don't know. I didn't ask. <laughs> I didn't fucking care. Do you like the Shiites? <laughs> super... Do you like the Shiites or the Sunnis? I honestly have no idea which one's which. Which one's ISIS? Wait, no, no. Which no. one am I? Shiites, I like that one. Shiites and Sunnis is like a Muslim thing. I think Sunnis, like, believe that after Muhammad died, his, like, apprentices and shit like you know pushed islam forward yeah. but like shiites believed muhammad's like relative or something like was like in charge of that shit that's afterwards why they kill each other. that's yeah. why they kill each other now it makes sense now i get it yeah it totally makes it. fucking sense now right such a good ass reason too anyways um all right let's go on have, uh, this is sock on I have sex with my son. My dad beats me. Wait, wait. <laughs> you, you can't put it towards the drum. It won't work. It's okay. I go into the grocery store and I see my son and I say, hey son, he's the register guy. I hit him in the fucking face. The manager comes out, he said, you can't beat the kid, that's domestic violence. I said, that's my son, so I sucked his dick. <laughs> <laughs> this is like the little worst podcast ever. I love it. <laughs> all, like, all this like fucked up shit. Yeah, I don't think we're going to use any of this. Yeah, we can use plenty of this. Can we please not like use all the shit that like it incriminates me? <laughs> and like, dude, I have a career, man. That's true, he has a career. Can job. we like... Get ready to lose your job. Hey! 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 Lose your job. You're gonna lose your job. You're gonna lose your job. I'm good. That's too hot. I'm gonna go outside. All right. I'm gonna call it. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, man. Thank you so much, man. Listen, I wanted this to be a good time. I wanted you to be in here. Yeah, it was a good time. Because if I did it alone, it would have been like not that fun. Yeah. But I'm glad you. I'm glad you joined. I'm glad we could. Do, I'm glad we could work it out. Yeah. Right. Hey, cl- you know, don't let the door hit you on the vagina on the way out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's time to close. Good job. Um, guys, if you're still watching, thank you. You know, I'm shirtless as fuck. It's been a good ass time. Uh. Episode 18 came to a close, man. You know what I'm saying? It was a good time being back in the studio. And we had fun. If you had fun, tell your fucking friends about Busty Buffalo, okay? The only way more people are going to hear about this is if you tell them about it. The best form of advertisement... What's the best form of advertisement, man? Uh. Word of mouth, little boy! Tell your mom... Hold on. Make it come this way. Tell your fucking mom. Tell your mom, dude. Tell your dad. Tell your sister. Tell your cousins. Tell your aunt. Hey, mom, I listened to this fucking podcast. It's called Busty Buffalo. You know? It's funny. Kid, a little foreign boy likes to talk in a micro in a microphone and say some crazy shit. You should totally listen to him. That's the only way this podcast is going to keep getting better. All right? It's going to keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And then my dick's going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. And then I'll be happy. You know? Anyways, dude. <laughs> uh, thank you guys for joining. Um, episode 18 is coming to a close. Dude, episode 18, man. Shit. Tw- what? It was 82? 82 fucking way for 100. It's a weekly thing. It's pretty cool. It's nice as fuck, man. It's nice as shit. Hey, man. If you enjoyed... Sponsor. Oh, yeah. Check out Taylor's Baked Goods on Instagram. That's it. (laughs) (laughs) You, like, fucked her on this one. Oh, dude, listen, all right? 
I'm sweaty as fuck, dude. It's so hot in here. We were told by my white friend that the AC was going to be on. It's not. It's just not on. You know what I mean? Or maybe it's... He oh, it's super... It it's over in time. It's literally super low. It's just so goddamn low. Listen. If you like it, subscribe. You don't... It doesn't matter. You fucking listen to it. You gave me a play, so suck my dick. You know what I'm saying? But thank you for tuning in, all right? It's been a great-ass time. I hope you all have a nice-ass fucking night. And stay safe. Don't do anything incestual. Don't give your se- don't give your sons that extra chromosome. You don't want that extra chromosome. And maybe you do. Maybe you like that. Kiss your sister. I don't fucking care. You got anything to say, man? Nope. All right. Assalamu alaikum, brothers. <laughs>